What's up guys? So today we're gonna go over some defenses from the front headlock, turtle, as your partner is transitioning to take your back. So we're gonna start with Chelsea in the front headlock. So if we're here, my favorite thing to do here is to post my head on the mat, which allows me to bring my hands up to hand fight, right? If I don't post my head on the mat, I have to stay on my elbows. This makes it more difficult for me to maneuver my arms. So I'm gonna post on my head. Now, I'm gonna take both my hands and I'm gonna push the arm that's around my head straight down to the ground, just like this, okay? Once I have it here, I'm just gonna dip back and break away just like that. You can stand up after that, you can wrestle, or you can sit back to guard, up to you. So, one more time. We're here, she's got me in the front headlock. So I post, two on one, push, dip back, just like that, right? So I'm dipping my whole body back as I go. Now, I believe in progressive layered defense. So obviously, as she's transitioning to take my back, I have to have something else, right? So if we're here in the front headlock, and now Chelsea starts circling, right? She starts circling, and she starts transitioning to her turtle harness. Freeze right there before she locks her harness, okay? Because I'm not going to be able to do this if she locks her harness. I'm not going to be able to follow. She's going to be able to follow me, okay? I'm going to tuck this arm that's right next to her, right? Get on my shoulder, and I'm going to invert, right? So I'm just going to invert back through. Maybe I catch a triangle. Probably not, though. Probably you'll just end up in the closed guard. But that inversion is a useful tool when someone is circling and trying to take your back. So Chelsea, one more time, please. So she's here. She starts circling hard, right? She starts circling hard. As soon as she, tra as soon as she transitions her harness, right, I invert and I get back to my guard. Now, let's say she was actually successful in getting her turtle harness. So again, proceeding with our layered defense, right? She gets here. She switches her harness. Oh no, I wasn't able to invert in time, right? She was really fast with the switch, okay? My favorite escape to do this is the trap and roll from here, okay? So I've seen people pinch at the elbow. I don't like this as much. This is very telegraphed. She probably knows what I'm going to do, right? Instead, I'm just going to grab the wrist on that side and I'm going to pinch here, okay? I still have a good tight grip on her but she may not see it coming as, um, because it's not as telegraphed as me going above the elbow here. So I'm gonna grab the wrist, pinch. Now I'm gonna bring my outside knee in just like that, and I'm gonna sit to my side and roll her through. So one, two, three. And now from here, if she still has her harness, I'm just gonna dip down, tuck my shoulder, and then I come on top. So let's do that again. Right, we'll go a little bit faster. So we're here in the front headlock. She starts circling, she gets her harness. Okay, I didn't invert. One, two, three. Sit here, dip down, and now I come on top, just like that, okay? So again, guys, multi-layered defense, that's what you want. As the position gets progressively worse for you, you should have something that you can attempt along each of those steps, right? Obviously, my two-on-one works, or if I do a sit-out, which isn't my preference, but some people like to sit out from there, or an arm drag from there and I get out from the front headlock, great. If she circles, I try inverting, I try getting back to my guard. If she gets to turtle, okay, now I've got the trap and roll. So you've always got an answer as things get worse for you. Although, obviously, if the early stuff works, it's always better. So always try to make the early stuff work. So thanks for watching, guys. Make sure you share this video if you like it and you think other people will too, especially if you're, you or they are getting stuck in the front headlock, getting stuck in turtle. Make sure you guys are subscribed to the channel as well. That really helps us. And you guys will be notified when we have new videos out there if you click the notification bell next to the subscribe button. Thank you guys so much. I'll see you guys next time.